I know from your other comments that you have been no contact for seven years. So um, that's going to help me in responding to what you're asking here. Writing a letter to your mother, what do you hope to get from that? What do you hope to gain? Are you looking for closure, for validation? Because likely she's not going to give it to you. So after seven years of no contact, you're going to break that no contact, write a letter, rip yourself open to let her know how she hurt you, give her that satisfaction and the ability to connect back to you to re-traumatize you. As a person who sees clients all day long who are either low contact or no contact, as somebody who has lived through this, I can tell you that writing a letter after seven years of no contact is going to do nothing for you except put you on pins and needles waiting for her reply and possibly giving her the opportunity to hoover you back in to punch you one more time. Because at the end of the day, if your mother wanted to make amends and have peace and love and a relationship with you, she could reach out to you she could apologize, take ownership of her behavior and create change, right? Make change, go to therapy with you, step up, be your mom. She's not doing that. So writing her that letter is going to put you in a place where, you know, you've made that connection and you're not going to get that closure. Closure, unfortunately, in these situations comes from our insides, comes from us. We have to find closure through making peace with the things that cannot be undone or changed.